Darling, you send me. I know you send me. Darling, you send me. Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am doing a huge wardrobe clear out. I've got the most. <laughs> got my leggings on these are new into missing me ones actually i'll link them below and i've got a big chunky jet for i'll link this below too i'll link most things that i comment like talk about below and i'm also going to sell loads on depop so i'll link my depop below um because i'm saving for a wedding so all proceeds go to my wedding dress <laughs> um so yeah basically i have just like i've run out of coat hangers i'm having to use jack's ugly coat hangers and that shelf looks like it's going to fall down <laughs> and there's, it's just an explosion, there's no room in this room. And we're moving to London soon, possibly in the next couple of weeks, who knows. Um, we're just literally waiting to hear back about flat and it's available now, so like we're just gonna move ASAP. So basically I'm long overdue a clear out. So this is gonna be a big old clear out. I'm not really sure where to begin, um, but yeah, I thought I'd show you guys because you always seem to be really interested in these kinds of things. I guess it's just like the nosy side of people because I love watching them too. So I've got itchy knees. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. If you haven't already, I'd love you to subscribe to my channel and leave me comments in the descriptions below. I miss so much when you guys leave me comments. Um, I always read them and comment back. So yeah, it means a lot. It means the world to me. Um, so yeah, let's get started. I think what I'm going to do is first off, I'm just going to like... I've got loads of bags and stuff hanging off of random things. So I'm going to show you those first and sort those out and then we can like go through the rest. Okay, so that's Jack's little tiny cubby hole of wardrobe. I've got this Chanel bag, which obviously I'm not going to get rid of. It's my favourite and it's new. That's the one I'm using at the moment, so that's why it's hanging up because it's got all my stuff in it. This bag from Topshop, I don't think I'm going to get rid of because I really like it, but... Um, and I use it quite a lot. No, I'm definitely not going to get rid of that one. It's really cute. I've actually used that quite a lot. You can see it in the mirror better. And then um, this bag is from Lulu's and it's new and you can fit loads in there. So that's quite good. I'm going to keep that. And that is like the cutest summer bag. I'm going to keep that. Then, so on the back here, just how I'm hanging up to dry. This is like my bag of bags and this is such a good bag. And this one as well is a basket bag. Um, but I can actually fit so much in there. So I think I'm going to use it in the winter for like blankets and stuff in the new house. And then this Kate Spade bag is new. So I'm not going to get rid of that. It's like perfect for autumn. I love the colour. And then that bag there is like my bag I take to London whenever I have to take my laptop. Because I can fit loads in it and it's really good. It's like a leather Everlane one. So, so far I'm not getting rid of anything. So then we have these bags here. And this bag I literally have used so much this summer. Can you see it? I've been literally used so much this summer and it's like my go-to bag so I'm not going to get rid of that. Because um, I am going on holiday again and also I don't think I'll get rid of it anyway. Just move that. Um, this bag is a really cute one I got from Elmi, um, and it was a gift. So I really don't want to get rid of that one and I just think it's a really nice like chic timeless bag. Ah, this isn't going well. This one I'm going to get rid of because it's just, it's cute but it's not like amazing it's like a little cross body one so that'll go on depop or I'll give it to my friends so one thing so far amazing <laughs> sorry about this light guys and then i've got this bag which i adore um from lulu's it's like a little basket bag it's got a little uh just put that on there a little um suffragette badge and then this backpack is also i think i'm gonna get rid of this backpack it's from um, Jigsaw, so it's quite a nice one, so I'll put that on Depop. Um, it's like a suede backpack. I've only used it like several times, but I've got my Chloe backpack now, and then I've got another bag that I use for my laptop and stuff. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of that one. And I have some more bags in here. I have this like beach bag, beach bag from Kate Spade. Um, and I really like it, and I love these things, but I haven't used it, and I've had it for over a year, so I think I'm going to get rid of it. Um, so that will possibly be on Depop, but it's so big I don't know how I'm going to post it. Then I also have this really cute bag from KU, um, but oh, I don't know if to keep or get rid of that because I have this bag and I have the other bag, so I don't know if I need that many basket bags, but this is like kind of designery, so I think I think I will keep that one because it is really cute and you can fit quite a lot in it, so I'm going to keep that. So 
I've got my fan bags here. Can you see? I've got like my shrimp bag. I'll never get rid of that. It's gorgeous. It's like this pearl handbag. I love it so much. So that's not going to go. My mulberry bag. I don't use this that much, but it's really handy to have because it's kind of like a smart, like it's mulberry base water and it's kind of like a smart bag to have. Um, I don't I don't think I'm going to get rid of many of my designer bags. My Chloe Faye, I'm not going to get rid of it because it's my like favourite first. This is the first designer handbag I bought and I will never get rid of it. And I still love it. It's perfect for autumn. Same colour as this Kate Spade bag. Chloe backpack staying, Gucci clutches staying. Chloe, this Chloe Drew I always think about getting rid of. But do you know what? I really like it. And I feel like the Western vibes are majorly in the season. So... I actually think I'll wear it quite a lot this autumn winter. Then my Liv Tom bag is staying. Um, that Marc Jacobs bag is staying. It's so cool. This one I really don't wear much because it's got silver on it. But I just don't think I could get rid of it because it's so gorgeous. It's the Aspinall um, box bag. Um, but I know it's got silver on it. But I do like it. And for some outfits it just looks so cool. Um, and it was a gift, so I definitely think I want to keep that. Um, and then I have got my little Chloe clutch, obviously my Chanel staying. My oh, this Gucci bag, I keep forgetting that I own this because I whenever I put the bags in just bags, it's hard to remember. Hoping in the new flat I have space to have them all out. Um, this is like one of my faves actually, um, so definitely not getting rid of that. Um, this bag I could get rid of. This is some ASOS, but I'm just like it's quite handy. Ooh, it's got a chain inside. It's quite handy for like events, but then no, I think I'm gonna get rid of that because I haven't got rid of anything else. <laughs> I'll get rid of that one bag, and then this one I don't know what to get rid of. Oh no, I don't want to. It's got my initials on it. I forgot that. This is like the other box bag, but this is pink. So maybe I should go with the other one. No, I can't because it's a gift and this is a gift and it's got my name on it, SC. Um, and it's just so cute. I might have this in the new flat actually open and like put my perfumes and stuff in it and have it more as like a kind of vanity case. So that was really unsuccessful. I've just got rid of one bag. Um, and now shoes. So one pair of shoes I'm definitely getting rid of are these over the knee boots. I mean, I do think they're good to just have, but they fall down and I just don't think they suit my style. Like, over the knee boots just aren't my style. And if I want some that are going to, like, stay up, I'm going to need to invest. So I'm going to get rid of those. Um, and then I've got these boots that are from Public Sire, which I really like, but I've just got these from um, Topshop and I think that they will, like do that job and they're nicer so i don't need those these boots i'm so torn every year every time i keep, do a clear out i don't know if to keep or get rid of these i think i'm gonna put them in like a maybe pile i might try them on with a few outfits and see i always want to keep them because they look like the acne ones and they're really nice and they're such a classic and they're so comfortable but i never wear them and i've had them for like two years and i've not only worn them a few times i wore them when i first got them like two years ago and then I haven't worn them since. I've had a whole winter since I got them and not worn them. So I think they're gonna go in a maybe pile. Um, and then my Chloe boots are staying. My favorite, these, I love these so much. Hoping to wear, I get more of them, uh, more wear out of them. These are my Balenciaga boots, my all time favorite, probably the best buy ever. And then my Chloe, um, not my Chloe, so these are Mark Fisher, um, but you can get them on Nordstrom. I'll link everything I talk about below. And so now I've got room for my new Topshop boots up here. And my new boots from Stradivarius, which are so cool. They've got like left, right on them. So I've got nearly, hopefully that around, I've got room for those. Now all my boots fit up there, which is like perfect. Um, so now this needs to be sorted out. So my Gucci loafers are gonna say, these are like my all time faves. They're so comfortable, the most worn shoes in the summer. My Golden Goose collection is like growing. They're going to stay. Love my Golden Goose. They're so comfortable. Um, now these I think I'm going to get rid of. Because I do really like them. But I do think they're too cool for me. Like I just think. Yeah. They're too cool for me. Um, so get rid of those. 
these are my Minebi espadrilles. I really like these, but haven't worn them, so I might put them in my maybe pile. No, I'm keeping them because I love them. They're the comfiest shoes I've ever owned, too. Um, these sandals are from Zara, and I think they're really cool and they're really comfortable. So I'm gonna keep those. These shoes really ought to go. They're like old Chloe dupes, but do you know what? They're so comfortable. I just can't bear to be parted with them, so I'm going to keep them. Um, and then I've got these shoes from that I got from New Look. I got them in two colours. I haven't worn either, so I think I'm just going to be ruthless and get rid of both. Uh, and then I've got another pair of Minerva Espadrilles. Again, the most comfortable shoes ever, so I'm going to keep those. Maybe I should get rid of those ones. I'm going to put these in my maybe pile, actually, because I haven't worn those yet at all. Um, these are mules from Topshop. I'm not sure, I'm going to put them in a maybe pile too because I do like them but I didn't wear them as much as I thought. I've got my new shoes from Revolve. My other Gucci loafers, didn't wear these that much. Um, I haven't worn these that much but I think I'll wear them more now and like this season. Castanias, these are going to go away for summer. My like, I still love those. We'll never get rid of those. Um, oh, these I think I'm going to get rid of because I really like them, but they're just a bit too cool for me again, so I'm going to get rid of those. I'm doing good on the shoe front, guys. I'm being, like, really brutal. So, I've got a pair of black mules here. I didn't wear these all summer, but they're really comfortable, and I just feel like a pair of plain black mules are, like, a good thing to have. So, I'm going to keep those. Um, these are, like, the comfiest shoes I've ever owned, my Saludos. Um, so definitely keep it. Um, these sandals are amazing. Nomadic state of mind ones. Another one just fell down. Keep those. So many sandals. These I think I'm going to get rid of. They're top shop. Um, they're just really uncomfortable. And I've got a pair that are really similar that are designer. Um, these ones. So I think I'm going to keep these ones because they're really similar. I don't need both pairs. I'm being ruthless. That's the other one of those. These ones, I don't know, because they're like Chanel dupes from Sky Jid, and I do really like them, but I just haven't worn them as much as I thought I would. I'm going to put them in my maybe pile. Um, and then that one is the other one to that one. These sandals, another reason why I don't need the other ones, because they're similar as well, and they're so much nicer. These sandals, I have not worn as much as I thought I would. So I think I'm going to get rid of them too. Um, they're top shop. I do really like them, but I know I'll have new next year. Then I've got these shoes, which are like Dior dupes from Mango. I really like them, so I'm going to keep those. Da -da -da. So now I can put my other my trainers back and have lots of room for them. Okay, so underneath my clothes rail is where you find this mess of trainers. Um, so these boots I tried to get rid of before and then when it snowed they were so handy because they're like painted and they've got so I'm going to keep those as like my snow boots so I think I don't think I think they're a bit too cool for me to wear every day um, like I'm not cool enough converse like everyone needs a pair of converse high tops um, these I wore the other day they did rub me but I'm going to keep them these ones are new look versions of the Sue Burgers and I think I'm going to get rid of them because I have got the Sue Burger version so I don't need two pairs really similar. I've got these Converse that are like high Converse as well. I've not worn them yet but I do really like them. I think I need to like, I hopefully I have more space um, in the new place. I think I'm going to get like a bookshelf for all my shoes and bags so I can actually see what I've got. Um, so I've got the Sue Burgers with the rope in white and also in navy here so let's organize those put them like that all together and then i've also got the pink velvet S um supergas and these are literally the comfiest shoes ever and then i've got <laughs> the white supergas literally so many pairs of supergas is unreal and then the navy ones, the navy ones can go down there. And so that's one, two, three, four, five pairs of sea burgers. It's really outrageous. 
And then I have these old Adidas Superstars, which I'm like, shall I just bin? But they're so comfortable, and I just like them for walking the dog. They're really comfortable. Oh, I'm going to keep those. So that was not... Oh, I got rid of one pair. So now we're onto the shelves. And knitwear. <sighs> I'm not gonna go through this one here because I know that is my new Burberry jumper, that is my new H&M jumper, that is my new Free People jumper, and this is my acne knit. So none of those will be going. So there's no point in going through them. So, oh God, there's so many knits. I have this knit, which I do really like because it's like kind of, um, I'm gonna put this in a maybe. It's really nice, but I'm gonna put it in a maybe. This one I'm going to get rid of because Lauren gave it to me and I've not worn it. So I'm going to get rid of that. Maybe give it back to her if she'll take it. Um, I've got this River Island one, which I do really like and I loved it last year. But I think I'm going to get rid of it. And then I've got two here from H&M. Um, this one they do every year. So I'll link it below if they've got it. It's so good. Um, and then I've also got like a jumper dress from them there. Oh, I need to do my sunglasses too. We'll do that in a minute. I've got loads of sunglasses. Literally it's too many. Um, and then, have I got another section of knits? Let's do knits. This jumper is Topshop and I really like that. It's like a cute off the shoulder soft one. This is, what is this? Oh my God, it's my And Other Stories one with the cricket sleeves. I'm gonna put that in maybe because I forgot I owned that. Um, and then I've got this like cropped. I'm gonna put that in maybe. I feel like my style's kind of changed quite a lot since last autumn winter and then i've got this jumper which i am gonna get rid of oh my god i'm being so ruthless guys i'm like really proud of myself okay so now jeans <laughs> so this pair of jeans are new and they're from girlfriend denim i'm not gonna get rid of any of my girlfriend denim ones because they're so comfortable and good these are a pair of new ones from barber and they're actually so comfortable like i've never had barber jeans before but i did a campaign with them which will be out soon so i can't show you these oh because it's product that's not out yet um, but they're so stretchy and comfortable. Like, I'd recommend their jeans. So these are girlfriend denim, just plain jeans. Love them. These are Tommy jeans, new. Love the back detail. So I'm gonna keep those. Ah! These are my. Just turning everything the right way around too. These are my pink jeans from girlfriend, and I love those. I think that was so nice in autumn winter with a pink, um, with a cream jumper or brown. Be nice pink and brown. Um, and then oh, I've got these jeans from Revolve, and I am actually going to get rid of them because they've got a big uh, gash here that you can't see. But look, I got them because the front looks so nice, and then I didn't look at the back, and the back had um, giant gash in it. So I am going to get rid of those. Um, I've got these jeans which are from. God, these are really old from ASOS, the Farley jeans. I love them though, I'm gonna keep those. They're like my all time faves, my favorite black jeans. Got they existed. And then I have these jeans, which are from Levi's. I'm gonna try those on, because I do have quite a few girlfriend jeans, so I'm gonna see which ones are best. So I'm gonna put those in my maybe pile. And I have these jeans from Primark, and I've literally had these for years, and I've not worn them in a couple of years, so I'm gonna get with those. Oh, I forgot about these jeans and I love them. They need a wash though, they're amazing. They're from Naked or NAKG, I love them. I'm gonna put them in the wash though. Um, see, I need more space so I can see what I've got. So these jeans are also, these are Levi. I think they're similar to the ones that I'm wearing. Yeah, they're like exactly the same as the ones I'm wearing. Do I need two pairs? I don't know. I'm gonna put them in a maybe pile. And then these are my ASOS Farley jeans. I will never get rid of them. ASOS Farley jeans, guys. High street, best high street jeans I've ever worn. Um, these are some skinny ripped jeans from River Island. I'm gonna try those. Black jeans from Everlane. I've never worn them. They've still got tags on. I'm gonna get rid of them. Um, and then these jeans are really cool from H&M. Uh, They're like cropped striped jeans. I love those. So I'm gonna keep those. So those are all my jeans. That's very aesthetically pleasing to me. Let's move my try on pile, because I've got loads here too. So, now I've got sh denim shorts and skirts. So, I've got my denim shorts. Keep those, love those. Then I've got these denim shorts, they're new, I love them. 
like kind of really cool ones. Denim skirt, best denim skirt I own, and it's on sale at the moment, so definitely worth getting it. It's from Girlfriend Denim. Oh, these jeans are so cool, but I don't know if I'll be able to fit in them now because I couldn't do them up before, so I'm going to try those on. Levi denim shorts, must keep. Levi denim skirt, must keep. <laughs> Oh, flared jeans that I nicked from Lauren's wardrobe and never wore. Must go. <laughs> Denim shorts from Lovers and Friends. Must keep. Um, and Levi denim shorts. Must keep as well. <laughs> Gotta have a selection, you know. Levi denim skirt. Must keep. Gotta have that. That's an absolute basic. Um, okay, what have we got here? This is a skirt from... She in and it's really old. I don't know if I'll do it up, but I'm going to try that on. These shorts are from New Look and they're actually really comfy and loose. So I'm going to keep those. I think we're into another level now. Skirt from Topshop. Very cute. I'm going to try it on, but I haven't worn that in ages. So. These shorts from Verge Girl are so cool, but I have to be honest and say I'm 28 and I can't wear little hot pants shorts anymore. Um, This skirt's really nice, but... Again, I've got two denim skirts. I think that's enough. Then this white denim skirt I'm going to keep because it's a good... don't have any white denim skirts. And then I've got this pink denim skirt from Topshop. I think I'm going to keep that because I think it's cute. OMG, look at that. What a transformation. And that is my pile to try. And that is my pile to go. Those two piles. So... Let's have a look at my sunglasses collection because I need to get rid of a lot here because there's probably meant to be eight pairs in here and there's about 80 as you can see. So there's 31 pairs of sunglasses here. Outrageous. So let's start with the fake glasses. We literally don't need any of those but I like them for pictures. But this pair is outrageous. They're going. Um, so those two can stay. We'll make a little section for fake glasses <laughs> blogger life um these two are, these are like my skinny sunnies so these two are really similar these ones are from lulu's i wore them yesterday they look really cool so those ones can go where are they from accessorized i think um these two key ones i really like so i think i'm gonna keep those those I think I'm going to get rid of. They still got tags on. Those I really like. They're so cool. But they literally do nothing for me. But don't want to keep the pictures. Let me hesitate on those. I don't like either of these pairs. They just don't suit me. These ones I have to keep. They're chimmy and I'm obsessed. These ones I love. These ones I love. So maybe I should get rid of these ones. So yeah. Um, so these skinny ones for now I'm going to keep but I might be more brutal. I kind of think maybe I could get rid of those. Hmm. Okay so these are like kind of the more classic ones. So I've got my Ray-Bans, my weekday ones which I adore. These are like my most worn probably. These Tommy Hilfiger ones are really nice. These are J Crew, and I've got them in a goodie bag and I really like them but I'm, I'm going to get rid because I won't wear them. I've got these Ray-Bans. I've got these from Chimmy Eyewear. These are Guess and these are, I think they're Polaroids. So I'm going to get rid of the Polaroid ones so I won't wear those. Um, and I'm kind of tempted to get rid of these Chimmy ones. I think I'm going to. Um, but those ones I'm going to keep, I think. <sighs> Much more manageable. And these are like fun ones. So I love these YSL dupe ones. I love the Chloe dupe ones. These Love Heart ones are really cute. So I think I am going to keep them because they're cute for pics. And then I've got my biggies, my big ones. So these ones I'm going to get rid of. These ones look really cool in pictures and I like them. These I like, but I just feel like someone else, I've never worn them. These ones, I love them, my Celine ones. These ones I think are really cool. They're from New Look. And then I've got these chimmy eyewear ones too, which I'm not sure about. Let me try these on actually. What do you guys think? I feel like I don't need both pairs, like these ones, reflective and pink, or these guess ones. Oh, now I'm thinking the pink ones are nicer. So now they all fit in perfectly, but I do think maybe I need another one because <laughs> this is still quite full, um, but yeah. There we go. 
another job done. Now on to the rails, which was the scary part that I was avoiding, as you could tell. Um, so the main point is I want to be able to get all my hang things onto nice hangers and not these like ugly ones. This is something new I just got. I haven't even tried it on yet. It's from other stories and I love the deep V. I think this looks nice with like a polo neck underneath maybe. And then I also got from them a blazer. Really nice. And I quite want it in a bigger size so I don't know if to ask them for that. Anyway. Then I've got some new things but this isn't a haul. So basically up till here's all the new things that I need to shoot. That's in the wrong space. So this dress is new, but I haven't worn it, and I know I'm not going to, so I'm going to get rid of that, because my friends will have that. Um, I've got this top from Rails, which is new, but I haven't worn it. Um, I don't know if I am going to wear that, you know. I'm going to be ruthless, I'm getting rid. Um, this dress needs to be in the dress section, and not in the other section. Um, this... I haven't worn, but I think I'm going to get rid of it because I've just had it for ages. I feel bad, but I mean, you just can't keep everything. Um, okay, so now we're on skirts. I've got this skirt, which I was definitely going to get rid of and like had it in my mind that I wasn't going to keep it. I just saw something else in it looking really cute. So now I'm like, I think I'm going to keep it. Um, but this skirt I'm definitely going to get rid of because I haven't worn it. It's still got the label on. Um, so when one of my ASOS hauls, I just thought I'd wear it. And then I've got this skirt from J Crew, which I really like, but it's too big on me. So I am going to get rid of that and be ruthless. Want to think it's kind of like it's not just not gonna happen fetch is not gonna happen this dress which like literally is obsessed with. oh this dress so many memories i wore this to henley with mr village if you saw my vlog and it's um diane von festenberg it's beautiful so now we're on to vest stops and i've literally got so many pairs it's unreal don't know why i said pairs so i've got this golden one which i just got can put stuff on there and hangers now this golden one which i just got from top shop is so nice so i'm keeping that then i have this one which is a body from mango that i haven't worn yet and it's so nice so i'm keeping that and then okay so if this cami this bra can go because i don't need that And then I'm going to try this. It's actually a top, but I don't know if it's too short now for me to wear um, from Faithful the brand. This cami from Verge Girl, I'm going to keep. I just love it so much. It's like so luxurious. Um, and then I have this, cam this top from Mango, which I never wore. And that makes me really sad because it calls me like Verge Bounds. I'm going to keep that because I think it's cute and timeless. Um... 
This one's so in Primark and it's so good. I'm keeping that. So I have this bandeau from Topshop, which I'm definitely going to keep. Oh, shell. And then I have this top from Pretty Little Thing, which I'm going to get rid of. I've never even worn that. Is it Pretty Little Thing? Yeah. Oh my gosh. So many things on so many hands. So I have all my intimacy me camis and they are not going anywhere because they are literally the best. They're like pure silk, pure silk camisoles. I'll just put them all in one hanger so I know where they are. Got three colours. I need to get some more. I want the cream one. Um, then I have this body from Revolve. I'm going to keep that. And then... I have this cami from H&M, which I love. It's just like really nice and silky. And I also have this cami from Other Stories, which I love, which is silky. So I'm keeping both of those. And this cami from Topshop, I've got in two colours. I've got it in, it's like a scallop one. I've got it in mint and white. So I've got on the same hanger, so I know where they are. So this pile here, whoa, is to go. 
and then that pile there is to try so I'll show you trying on some of them but not all of them obviously and then you can see there's like so much more room and space and it's so much tidier so yeah that's amazing I do need to clear out my beauty stuff as well um like I've got loads of jewelry like none of my Pandora jewelry is going but I've got loads of other brands that I don't really wear anymore so I might clear out that as well and the beauty but I might just do that in a vlog so make sure you keep up to date with my vlogs if you want to see those now I'm really torn on this one because I do really like it but I also really think I've got my acne coat now so do I need this one and I'm trying to cut down and I no, no doubt we'll be getting so many coats this season too this is like a teddy bear fur one I'm really torn I do really like it. I think I might keep this one. This one I think I am going to get rid of. Because even though I do think it's really freaking cool. I just don't know if I'll wear it again next year. This year. I don't think I will. So I think I'll get so many new ones. So I'll just end up not wearing it. I have to show you guys this one. Excuse my pants. But seriously. Oh. This is not going to do it. <laughs> I can safely say. These jeans, it's got a zip all the way around, by the way. That's why it's done so much, but yeah. Oh, not gonna happen. Daisy's safeguarding those things. So those are the things I'm gonna keep, that pile there of the things I tried on, so most of it. And then here's a massive pile of things I'm gonna get rid of. I got rid of most of the shoes apart from these ones. I'm not sure what to do, I'm still gonna ask Jack. And then I kept these ones, because these are really new. I don't know how they end up in the pile, to be honest. Um, these ones and these ones because I have got Balenciaga ones like this but I was like I don't want to be wearing them and ruining them so it'd be nice to have a pair that are like cheaper um, and these I just thought they looked really nice with jeans so I was like oh I will keep them and then these I do actually love them so <laughs> kept them too and then in terms of the clothes I kept most of the jet denim which is why it looks like a lot I, kept, I, got, I got rid of most of the denim jackets and stuff but I kept most of the denim Daisy's looking after it for me so I hope you guys like my wardrobe clear out. Keep your eyes open on Depop because I'm, I'm actually going to put some stuff up today. So I'll try and get this uploaded so you guys can have like a little look if you want anything to. And I will see you soon. Bye.